So it's Roundup herbicide that's specially formulated for big jobs. That's the new one. On uh, this one, it says biodegradable. That's the old one. It doesn't say biodegradable anymore, so it must no longer be biodegradable. It's the same product. I imagine they don't have the right to say it anymore. It must not really be biodegradable. Be careful not to spray it in my face. Oh, I'm not a murderer. Well, I'm sure these Roundup Ready soybeans are ready to harvest today. They're probably about... I'm going to say about 11.5% moisture, so they're perfect for harvest. First heard about Roundup Ready soybeans in a farm magazine about eight years ago, and uh, it seemed like a neat in innovation. The soybean has a protein genetically inserted into the plant, and it's resistance of Roundup. The Roundup is sprayed on the plants. There are some definite advantages. If you look at our, my field here, you don't see weeds. When label directions are carefully followed, Roundup is not harmful to humans, animals, or their environment. Copyright Monsanto, made in Belgium. If you see any snails, don't spray them because they'll be inedible. So watch the strawberries. I'd encourage European farmers to take a look at the Roundup Ready technology. Frankly, it's very good for the environment. It's a sustainable system. So give it a try. Monsanto. For 20 years I've traveled the globe, and everywhere I've heard about this American multinational. But what I've heard hasn't always been positive. Wanting to know more, I surfed the web for months to put the pieces of the puzzle together. On its website, Monsanto positions itself as an agricultural company that aims to help farmers produce healthier food while reducing agriculture's impact on our environment. Its leading product is Roundup, the world's best-selling herbicide for the last 30 years. One shot. All it takes for weeds. Roundup. Monsanto is also the world leader in biotechnology. 90% of the GMOs grown on the planet belong to them. Most of them have been genetically modified to resist the application of Roundup, like Roundup-ready soybeans. Monsanto's GMOs have invaded the planet, but no ag industry product in history has ever incited as much controversy and passion. Why? What's at stake with GMOs? And could the company's past shed some light on what the company is or claims to be today? Founded in St. Louis, Missouri in 1901, it was not always an agricultural company. It was one of the largest chemical companies of the 20th century. Chemistry is working for you. And very likely Monsanto is working for you. Monsanto, where creative chemistry works wonders for you. The wonders boasted about in this commercial made Monsanto one of the most controversial companies in the industrial era. <laughs> 